I'm Judy Larson, director of the Westmont Ridley Tree Museum of Art, and I want to discuss a print by a woman artist. Her name is Maria Caterina Prestel. It was really hard for women to get training. We do know that she took drawing lessons with an artist in Nuremberg named Johann Prestel, and obviously the two fell in love and married and started their own printing business. They had four children, and for a while they were successful because the two developed a very uh, difficult technique that they added precision to, and that technique was called aquatint. Now, when you come and see this print, it would be great if you brought a magnifying glass because these different browns, the beige, the brown, the dark brown, um, you can tell it's all granular color, and that comes from aquatint. The one thing I love about their technique, and it may have been something that Maria Caterina herself developed, is look at these bright gold shimmering lines. For a long time, it's been debated whether those were printed or drawn, but when you look closely, they are printed on top of the brown tonal aquatint, and they lend this terrific shimmering quality to a print. The subject here comes from a drawing by an Italian old master, and it is the triumph of truth over vice. Uh, it has various other titles, but truth is represented by a woman, and she's ready to strike vice, who's obviously going to lose this battle. The interesting thing about Maria Caterina Prestel is that the marriage dissolved after a bankruptcy, and she took the four children and moved to London. Now, it had to be hard for a woman to support herself alone, but because she had these skills as an aqua tint printmaker, she was able to secure work with a publishing firm named Boydell, and I'm sure her skills were the envy of everyone else, and she did support the family by making mainly landscape prints, reproductive prints in London that were distributed all over Europe. It's a highly unusual print, being by a woman artist, and also uh, by a technique that was the first here, really developed later, a German artist who ends her career in London. Mm -hmm.